he dropped a bombshell on her during Monday's episode of The Bachelorette. And Colton Underwood has defended Becca Kufrin's reaction to his reveal that he's a 26-year-old virgin in a tweet. In response to the 28-year-old's claim that by standing up and leaving the date she was simply going to the bathroom, the NFL Titan wrote, can confirm. There was zero intent to be disrespectful. I definitely did not take it that way. The Indiana native was candid in a Monday Instagram post in which he discussed his decision to go public with his life choice. On tonight's episode I talk about something I typically avoid talking about at all costs, but it was appropriate for me to bring up, he wrote. Anyone who feels like they are hiding their truth out of embarrassment or fear of being judged. I have been there. I have covered up my truth with lies and tried to fit in, while I thought fitting in was what I wanted. I've recently learned that being different is what I need. I ask for respect from everyone I meet moving forward and I'm here to call on everyone that needs that extra motivation to be different. Here it is. Be who you are. I love you all. Underwood finally told Becca Q. Fern about his lifelong chastity on Monday's episode of The Bachelorette, before getting a rose. The Minnesota publicist appreciated the honesty and kept him for the hometown dates. Wills Reed, a 29-year-old graphic designer, was sent home in tears following the rose ceremony. Long hair and Leo Dottavio, a 6 feet 4 inches, stuntman also was ejected during a group date. Blake Horstman, a 28-year-old sales rep and modern romantic, was the first man of the season to tell Becca he's in love with her. The show opened with Becca praying for no drama in Nassau, Bahamas. I'm falling for a couple of guys here, admitted the former fiancé of Ari and Jr. The first date was with resident virgin Colton a former pro football player and the ex-boyfriend of gymnast Tally Raisman and former The Bachelor contestant Tia Booth. The couple took a boat ride, performing the classic Titanic move on deck. Snuggles in the sunshine were followed by diving for Kong, A, K, A, the Bahamian Viagra. I'm really impressed with Colton, he really knows how to work that Kong, cooed Becca, adding, I don't think Colton and I need any aphrodisiacs. At dinner he dropped the bombshell. I put my professional life before my personal life. And I spent a lot of time working on football Colton, he said, adding, I still am a virgin. Really? She asked incredulously. It is something now that I'm proud of, he continued. Becca thanked him for the information, then awkwardly excused herself. While she stared wistfully across the bay, Colton fretted at the table. I'm scared he said. On her return Becca probed him gently about the matter. In the past I was scared, I was ashamed, because growing up in a locker room environment isn't the easiest for a guy like me, he said. I made up a lot of lies just to fit in. I'm waiting for the right heart. I want it to be a special moment. I want that to be a gift to give to somebody, he continued. I respect you for that so much, she said, before giving him a rose. Garrett Yrigoyen a 29-year-old medical sales rep from Nevada, got the next one-on-one. -on -one. 